These days, with internet, mobile or telephone banking, you could be forgiven for thinking you could manage your money without ever setting foot in a bank. However, reports of the demise of branches are misplaced. The bank branch still has plenty of life in it, with nearly 10 million customers every week in the UK visiting the Barclays branch. Barclays' investment in customer-focused branch design is already making an impact across Western Europe. Here, branch designs in each country reflect local cultures. In France, the majority of customers are Premier Life customers, and branches are quite different. Thousands of service personnel in the British forces have been wounded in the past decade, and the number continues to grow. In 2010, nearly 5,000 ex-servicemen and women were living on the streets. This is where Barclays has stepped in to help, partnering with the Army Recovery Capability, or ARC, to help ex-soldiers integrate back into civilian society. Corporal Dean Upson served in the Army, where he witnessed traumatic incidents in his work in bomb disposal that led to him developing post-traumatic stress disorder. Time now to reveal the latest Limelight Award winners. Paula Haycox and Trisha Mukundola Tembo, who we featured earlier in the programme, pick up two of the awards this month. And the IT team in Italy is another winner for their Back to the Floor programme. The team visited branches to improve retail processes, which ultimately saved colleagues a combined 300 hours a day. This year, a total of 270 branches in the UK will receive a makeover. But while technology advances at an incredible pace, face-to-face -face services will still be a part of everyday banking for the foreseeable future.